My name's Jennifer. I'm a shift lead and I've been with Banfield for six years. I'm Marissa Rothenbaum. I'm a veterinarian on the veterinary quality team. I've been with Banfield since 2011. Hi, my name is Lucas Calter. I served in the United States Air Force for six years. I'm Dr. Sarah Doherty. I've been with Banfield for about 10 years. I'm associate veterinarian at Cedar Mill. My name's Dr. Lori Brown. I am a locum vet with Banfield and I've been working with the company for about five years now. Being able to volunteer with Stand Down actually has a lot of personal meaning for me. I come from a military family. My father um, served over 20 years in the U.S. Navy. Just supporting military and veterans specifically is something that I've been passionate about for a while. And so this is a wonderful opportunity for me to be able to give back to that community that, quite frankly, I feel has given a lot to me. This one in particular is pretty special to me. Um, most of my family has served in the military. Uh, my partner's currently actually deployed right now in the Middle East. Being able to give back to the entire Portland community, um, particularly veterans, is pretty special to me. Volunteering at an event like this, especially a stand down, means a lot to me. My husband is a two-time um, veteran in Iraq with the Marine Corps, and we have a lot of friends and family who are veterans, so it means a lot to me to give back to this community. This event is important to me, not because we just give back to our community and our pets, but our veterans make a strong sacrifice in protecting our country, and to have the opportunity to really help them with their pets just is something so much more powerful. For me personally, it's a way to give back and stay close to the vet community. Uh, more importantly though, I think it's just important to stay close to this population of wonderful people and make sure that they're never forgotten. I absolutely love it. There has been so much that they have sacrificed to serve our country, to allow us to have the life that we have today. And it's the absolute least that I can do to make sure that their loved ones, their pets, and who are a very important part of their family, get the care that they need and give back to veterans through love, snuggles, and kisses. Being able to give back to veterans and specifically, obviously, their pets, I think is so important because a lot of these individuals are oftentimes in really difficult situations and their pets are just such an important and integral part of their ability just to kind of survive and also to be able to kind of have that interactions with another living being and knowing how much those pets are giving back to those veterans, I think it's wonderful to be able to make sure that those pets stay healthy because, you know, quite frankly, they deserve it. Being a vet on Veterans Day, I just want to say thank you to not only those who are currently serving, but those who have served. Thank you for doing such a hard job and giving up a part of your life to do things that a very small percentage of Americans do. It doesn't seem like enough, but thank you. Thank you very much for the sacrifices you made. We're all fortunate for it and we're all very appreciative of everything that you've done.